The final test is based Safety protocol for the jet. Eh, it's on the clipboard. Look, do we really have to do this, all things considered? We're putting a pasty faced egghead inside a Mach 3 fighter jet. Yeah, I kind of think we do. <sighs> I get it, I get it. Safety first and all that. I don't care which one of you does it, it's mandatory. Just tick the box and get it done. So. Jasper Knight is leaving Cuba on a Soviet fighter jet, but first he needs to test the jet's safety features. Huh. Say you could somehow tamper with the ejector seat mechanism. You could presumably get Knight to trigger his own demise. Hmm. That might just work. KGB officer? That's yeah. That's what years of special KGB training in Siberia do. They say it's tigers with a bow and arrow. Come on. Seriously. They even say he works directly for Janus. Takes orders from no one. Really? I know. The guy's a real killing machine. We're lucky he's on our team. I'll drink to that, comrade.
Naturally, Kremlin says no, wasn't part of the agreement. Knight says he got done. Right, now to set the trap. The ejector seat mechanism has been disabled. You may need a tool to re-enable it. Well done, Initiate. I dare say this is an accident waiting to happen. Security's tight here. We're not letting you guys through. Sorry, man. You know how it is. Mr. How's the mechanic today? Jesper Knight, we gotta go over the safety protocol. Follow me, please. Ugh. Must we really? Is it dangerous? Well, it must be, mustn't it? Why else would there be a safety protocol? I'm not crazy about airplanes. Is it going to do that thing where it flips on its head? I don't like that one bit. Not one bit. Don't worry. You're in good hands. This way, please. Okay, Mr. Knight. Climb in the cockpit, please. Uh-huh. All right. Easy. One. 
one step at a time. Step one, strap yourself in. Uh, okay, all strapped in. Step two, locate the ejector seat handle. Yes, found it. Step three. Pull the ejector seat handle. Right. Here it goes. Pull. Target down. You did it. Now head towards an exit. Congratulations, Agent. You are cleared for field duty. I hope you know what you just did. The chopper leaves at dawn. Now get out of my sight. So what happens now? You go back into the world, disappear, stay on your own and on the move. When we need you, we will contact you. And so does. He played his hand, and he lost. He cannot touch us now. <laughs> Still, I can't believe we beat him at his own game. If you know your enemy. <laughs> Quite right. I should tell you, the trail went dead after Romania. Our team found no records of any kind, no name. Nothing. I think they called me 47. That's not a name. So make it one. All right. Agent 47.
Good evening, 47. Your destination is the Paris Fashion Show by Sanguin, one of Europe's leading couture brands. Your targets are Sanguin owner Viktor Novikov, a former oligarch turned fashion mogul, and his partner Dahlia Margolis, a retired supermodel, an iconic power couple on the global fashion scene, and two of the most dangerous people in the world. Novikov and Margolis are in fact the ringleaders of Iago, an enigmatic spy ring that deals in the global elite's most valuable secrets. Unscrupulous and opportunistic, Iago has caused disastrous security leaks all over the globe. When Crimean separatists caused a deadly meltdown at the Odessa nuclear power plant, Iago gave them access to the plant security network. And when the Delgado drug cartel shot down the plane of President Hernandez and his family, Iago provided the classified flight plans. Now Novikov and Mogolis have obtained a knock list of British undercover agents, which they plan to sell at a secret Iago auction during the Sanguine show. So our client, MI6, need us to stop the ringleaders before the knock list ends up in the wrong hands. The Sanguine show will be swarming with security, and Viktor Novikov will be the focus of everyone's attention. But despite his posturing, he is merely the money man. The real target is Dahlia Margolis. Beautiful and brilliant, she is a master manipulator and the true brains behind Iago. Two targets, a highly public event. At first glance, an impossible task. Then again, I do know how you love a challenge. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Paris 47. The show is just about to start. This is the red carpet event of the season and the guest list is a veritable who's who of the global fashion elite. You will find Viktor Novikov basking in the spotlight, while Dalia Margolis hosts the heavily guarded auction on the second floor for a group of Iago's top customers. Now, event security will keep a watchful eye on any suspicious activity, but I trust your timeless look shall fit right in. Good luck, 47.
Sanguine, a house usually associated more with continuity than innovation. Whether Sato, the archetypal left-field artist, and Novikov, the quintessential capitalist, are a match made in heaven or an unholy union remains to be seen. Either way, this evening has already had a fair share of surprises. Just a moment ago, I saw none other than Valerie St. Clair arriving. Secret exchange at the pavilion, very cloak and dagger. Who's the contact again? Max Decker of the Russian FSB. I don't know, some Cold War dinosaur. Well, must be pretty important for Novikov to take time out during the show. We should go check out the place. Assess security risks. It's pretty exposed for my tastes. Let Kurt worry about that. We've got enough on our hands. Novikov is meeting Max Decker, a senior agent in the Russian FSB. Small world. The FSB has been mounting a criminal case against Novikov, but Decker's boss, FSB Section Chief Nikolai Kamarov, committed suicide only last night. Or perhaps not. Either way, this could be a chance to catch Novikov away from the spotlight. Regulations. I assure you, our staff will take excellent care of your vehicle. Otherwise, you'll need to find a public space. This is preposterous! Do you have any idea who I am? Uh, not a clue, sir. But a famous bigwig like you 